Well, here in Lexington, it appears anger over the outcome of the election was behind some overnight vandalism. And the Republican Party of Fayette County's building on Southland Drive was damaged overnight. WKYT's Lauren Miner caught up with someone who works there. Lauren? It's obvious to see the damage that has been done outside here of the GOP building. The chairman who works inside the building tells me that a dumbbell was thrown through the door overnight. Not a good way to wake up. Carol Rogers is the chairwoman of the Republican Party of Fayette County and works inside the office. You know, one of the highlights of our country is we have elections every four years, well, every year in November, and then some people are happy, some people are not happy, and we move on peacefully. Rogers says she learned that the door had been shattered from a volunteer who just happened to be driving by. It's really a sad reflection on our whole society, and there. That, that's not the way we do after elections. You know, we, I've been involved in plenty of elections that we've lost, and you're sorry about that, but you just get up the next day and move on. Lexington police were called to the Fayette County GOP office around 2 this morning. At this time, they still don't know who's responsible. We have elections. Sometimes we win, sometimes we lose. If you're unhappy about it, that doesn't give you the right to destroy private property or to hurt people. Police say yesterday evening remained pretty calm, and this was the only incident they were called to on election night. Reporting in Lexington, Lauren Miner, WKYT. Lauren, thank you. And Roger says the door will be replaced this afternoon.